What if your sound quality sucks? Because you, you got this really high-tech camera and you want to level up the sound or you want people to be able to hear you. What do you do to fix your sound quality? Well, you could get really good at fixing the sound quality from the camera that you have with its built-in microphone. You could. Or... You can invest in something that's going to future-proof you a little bit and give you a lot more options moving forward and level up your sound by getting a better microphone or getting a shotgun microphone to begin with, which is where the Deity V mic, it's got a really long, interesting name. I'm just going to call it the Deity Duo. It's where this bad boy comes in. And when you look at it first without these dead cats on it, It does come off as looking a little odd. And that's probably going to be the only odd thing that you see about it. It fixes a lot of the issues that you have with the traditional shotgun mic. Where if someone is holding your camera for you, or if there just so happens to be some audio from somewhere else around it that you wanted to add in, it's going to be muffled because the original, they're all just, bam, facing one way. So you get all that great sound quality from that one, pour it in. Now, you have the option of both. If you decide you want to go one way or the other, you have the option with the switch that isn't built in there. And that's initially my thought, my worry, was that it was going to pick up all the sound in one, in just all around. Not the case whatsoever. It records two separate audio files from both directions. Gives you the option to edit that in post. Now, what does the sound quality sound like? Because I'm holding it right here. Good question. This is a sound inside with nothing else added to it with the Deity D4. How now, brown cow? This, this is our sound outside with the Deity D4. How now, brown cow? This is our audio outside with the Deity D4. How now, brown cow? Testing the audio forward and backwards outside. So, what you doing? I am unscrewing, not unscrewing. I'm making these looser so I can put them on the walls for our Christmas tree. Yeah. So that's the sound quality there. Not touched up, not messed with whatsoever inside and outside to give you something to to kind of work with now at the time of recording this video i've seen prices from 45 to about 70 so i can only assume that there are different packages whatever what have you the one that i picked up was just 60 so it's just this one with the dead cats the bear package and obviously your 3.5 but phenomenal it does everything that you need and if you decide that you want to level up your sound quality, level up your, your recording process a little bit more in the future, you can rig this bad boy up and use it as a boom mic, however you want to use it. And again, it's always good when you can get gear and equipment that is going to, you know, easily pay for itself and have multiple uses moving forward because uh, all this is kind of expensive, kind of pricey when you start adding it up. So it's good when some things have multiple purposes and can save you some money to spend that. So far in my using it, I've absolutely loved it. I've found very little to almost no downsides. That was actually in writing the script and getting everything together with this one. That was the, the difficulty that I ran into. And just to, just to leave it there, I left the cons on there and just forced something on there. But... What microphone are you using is going to be my question for you. If you're not using any at all, and if you're not, then why? Or if you've found any pros and cons with the Deity D4 so far, please let me know, because I haven't found any. But highly recommend, absolutely phenomenal, 10 out of 10. So you want to level up your sound. And you got a couple extra dollars, 
you want to find a microphone that is going to be good long term and is going to you know future proof you a little bit give you a couple extra options traditionally you're stuck with the regular just regular shotgun mic nothing wrong with these but you would always come up a little lacking if someone behind you was talking or you know if you wanted to if you wanted to flip it around but now we have an answer to that problem the Deity D4 Duo it's got this really long interesting name Deity V my D4 Duo microphone mini portable voice recorder cardioid yeah capsule microphone and the great thing about this one is the fact that it does record from front and back. When you have it on your camera, let's see it. so uh, you have it on your camera. Bam! You'll notice that, like every other. Every other capsule microphone, shotgun microphone, sticks forward a little bit, but you have that backwards facing microphone that does stick out a little bit. Something to get used to, does look a little odd when you first get it, does look a little off balance, and that honestly is the only con that I've found so far. With the exception of every now and again, it, it's a good microphone, but the windscreen, the dead cab, whatever we want to call it, will still pick up some of the excess sound. Only con that I found, but it's not anything that you yourself can't fix with just a little bit of, you know, learning your software. Now, a lot of pros, very few cons. That was honestly the only con that I could find. <clears throat> when you pop off the wind, windscreens, dead cats, you'll see that on the side of the microphone, come on, Help me out. Side of your microphone here, you have the two switches that lets you decide if you want to leave it on forward facing or front and back. Now, my initial thought was that it was going to record all around. Not the case, because it does have two microphones, bam. It splits and gives you two separate audio files so that during your editing process, you have two different audio files to pick from. So if you got better sound quality or if someone behind you said something, you have that option to split that up or add them together, chop it up how you want, which is absolutely phenomenal. And the sound quality from both, absolutely amazing. If you look on the microphone, it does seem a little odd because the back one is a little bit smaller. However, it's smaller because it's going to be right about the exact space that would be away from your face while someone holding the camera or someone behind it would be talking. So having one that's going to be, that would be twice the size as both, or don't put it on sideways, 